in the name of allah the most beneficent the most merciful my name is nalek bal i am from west chemistry department and my id is yon 5 now i am going to present my presentation and the topic of my presentation is named reactions with complete detail and applications the first one is sandmeyer's reaction in this reaction benzene diazonium chloride is converted to chlorobenzene bromobenzene cyanobenzene or treatment with cocl hpl and cucnr kcl respectively this is the reaction these are the reaction conditions and mechanism applications of sandmeyer's reaction variations on the sandmeyer reaction have been developed to fit multiple synthetic applications these reactions typically proceed through the formation of an aryl diazonium salt followed by a reaction with a copper one salt to yield a substituted aryne some examples of the synthetic applications of the sandmeyer reaction are provided below the, the first one is halogenation <clears throat> one of the most important use of the sandmeyer reaction is the formation of aryl halides the solvent of choice for the synthesis of aryl iodides in di iodomethane while for the synthesis of aryl bromides bromo form is used for the synthesis of aryl chlorides chloroform is the solvent of choice the synthesis of curcuminol a bioactive compound that displays antifungal and anti cancer activity employs a sandmeyer reaction to substitute an amine group by a bromo group one bromination protocol employs a co copper one or copper two mixture with additional amounts of the bidentate ligand phenanthrolin and phase transfer catalyst dibenzo adin crown 6 to convert an aryl diazonium tetrafluoroborate salt to an aryl bromide the bells schiemann reaction uses tetrafluoroborate boret and delivers the halide substituted product fluorobenzene which is not obtained by the use of copper fluorides this reaction displays motifs characteristic of the sandmeyer reaction another example is cyanation another use of the sandmeyer reaction is for cyanation which allows for the formation of benzo nitriles an important class of organic compounds a key intermediate is in the synthesis of the anti psychotic drug fluoranzol is synthesized by a cyanation through the sandmeyer reaction the sandmeyer reaction has also been employed in the synthesis of new amphimidine a compound that is suggested to target top topo isomerase 2 as an anti cancer drug another application is trifluoromethylation it has been demonstrated that sandmeyer type reactions can be used to generate aryl compounds functionalized by trifluoromethyl substitute Different groups. This process of trifluoromethylation provides unique chemical properties with a wide variety of practical applications. Particularly, pharmaceuticals with CF3 groups have enhanced metabolic stability, lipophilicity, and bioavailability. Sandmeyer type trifluoromethylation reactions feature mild reaction conditions. and greater functional groups tolerance relative to earlier methods of trifluoromethylation another example of a sandmeyer type trifluoromethylation reaction is present below hydroxylation the sandmeyer reaction can also be used to convert aryl amines to phenols proceeding through the formation of an aryl diazonium salt as shown below in the presence of copper catalyst This reaction takes takes place readily at room temperature. The procedure reported by Cohen and co-workers calls for the cuprous oxide 
together with their excess of cupric nitrate in neutral water. This is in contrast to the classical procedure which calls for boiling the disonium salt in aqueous acid, a process that is believed to involve the aryl cation instead of radical and is known to generate other neutrophilic addition side products in addition to the desired hydroxylation product. Triazine. Treatment with the second equivalent of aniline would give a triazine. The second named reaction is Finkelstein reaction. The Finkelstein reaction named after the German chemist Hans Finkelstein is an SN2 reaction that involves the exchange of one halogen atom for another. It is an equilibrium reaction but the reaction can be driven to completion by exploiting the differential solubility of halide or by using a large excess of the halide salt. Examples of Finkelstein reaction. Converting ethyl chloride to ethyl iodide in the presence of sodium iodide and acetone. It, converting ethyl bromide to ethyl iodide in the presence of sodium iodide or acetone. This is the mechanism of the Finkelstein. Applications of Finkelstein reaction. Use for analysis. Alkyl halides differ greatly in the ease with which they undergo the Finkel Finkelstein reaction. The reaction works well for primary halides and exceptionally well for allyl, benzyl, and alpha carbonyl halides. Secondary halides are far less reactive. Vinyl, aryl, and tertiary alkyl halides are unreactive. As a result, the reaction of sodium iodide in acetone can be used as a qualitative test to determine which of the aforementioned class, classes an unknown alkyl halide belongs to, with the exception of alkyl iodides, as a yield the same product upon substitution. Below some relative rates of reaction. In modern usage, the definition of the reaction has been expanded to include the conversion of alcohols to alkyl halides by first converting the alcohol to a sulfonate ester and then performing the substitution. The example below is from a synthesis of chrysocolmic acid. Aromatic Finkelstein reaction. The aromatic chlorides and bromides are not easily substituted by iodide, though they may occur when appropriately catalyzed. The so-called aromatic Finkelstein reaction is catalyzed by copper one iodide in combustion with diamine ligands, nickel bromide and tri and butyl phosphine have been found to be suitable catalysts as well. Words, words reaction. Alkyl halides react with metallic sodium in the presence of dry ether to form alkanes. This reaction is used for the preparation of higher alkanes. For example, methyl iodide react with sodium in the presence of ether to form ethane. This is the mechanism. Applications. Words reaction is only useful for the preparation of alkanes containing even number of carbon atoms and not for the alkanes containing odd number of carbon atoms. The fourth one is words fitting reaction. Allyl halides when treated with alkyl halide and sodium in dry ether gives alkyl benzenes. Mechanism Applications of words fitting reaction. The words fitting reaction has limited applicability since site reactions such as rearrangements and eliminations are 
plant. However, the reaction is useful for the laboratory synthesis of organosilicon compounds. Although they, there are challenges in adapting the procedure to a large-scale industrial process, organosilicon compounds successfully synthesized via the Wurzbach reaction include silylated glycerins, T-butyl silicon compounds, and vinyl silanes. For example, uh, T-butyl <coughs> triethoxy silane can be prepared via the worst fitting reaction by combining tetraoxy silane, <coughs> T-butyl chloride, and molten sodium. The reaction proceeds with a 40% yield. Fittings reaction. In this reaction, two molecules of haloarane combine with metallic sodium in the presence of dry ether to give diphenyl or biphenyl. Friedel-Crafts alkylation. Benzene and other aromatic compounds react with alkyl halides in the presence of anhydrous AlCl3 to form alkyl benzene. This is the reaction and this is the mechanism of Friedel-Crafts alkylation. Dose process. When chlorobenzene is treated with an aqueous solution of sodium hydroxide at 6 to 3 Kelvin, 300 atmosphere pressure, Sodium phenoxide is formed, which on acidification gives phenol. Mechanism of dose process applications. Preparation of phenol. Dose process may also refer to the hydrolysis of chlorobenzene in the preparation of phenol. Benzene can be easily converted to chlorobenzene by electrophilic aromatic substitution. It is treated with aqueous sodium hydroxide at 350 degree and 300 bar or molten sodium hydroxide at 350 degree to convert it to sodium phenoxide, which yields phenol upon acidification. When one carbon 14, one chlorobenzene was subjected to aqueous Sodium hydroxide at 395. Ipso substitution product 1 carbon 14 phenol was formed in 54% yield, while sine substitution product 2 carbon 14 phenol was formed in 43% yield, indicating that an elimination addition mechanism is predominant, which perhaps a small amount of product from addition elimination. And stickers reaction. Bromal canes are obtained by this method by reflecting silver salts of fatty acids with Br2 in C, Cl4. Mechanism applications. Borrowed and Hans Dicker reaction is used to prepare mainly alkyl bromide and alkyl chloride from the silver salts of salts of carboxylic acid. Besides, this reaction is applied to decrease the carbon chain. Gottermann's reaction. The reaction of diazonium salts with copper powder in the presence of corresponding halogen acids is known as Gottermann's reaction. This is the example. Mechanism of Watersman reaction. Applications. Gottenman reaction is used for obtaining chlorobenzene or bromobenzene from benzene diazonium chloride by treating it with Cu or HBr respectively. Kolb's reaction. The Kolb's Schmidt reaction or Kolb process is 
a carboxylation chemical reaction that proceeds by heating sodium peroxide with carbon dioxide under pressure 100 atm 125 degree then treating the product with sulfuric acid the final product is an aromatic hydroxy acid which is also known as salicylic acid it is addition reaction This is the mechanism. Applications. Kolb reaction can be used in converting sodium acetate to ethane. Using the Kolb electrolysis process, the aqueous solution of sodium acetate is electrolyzed. The acetate ions get decomposed and form methyl radicals. These combine with other free methyl radicals, which leads to the generation of ethane. Rimer Timon reaction. The Rimer Timon reaction is a chemical reaction used for the ortho formulation of phenols, with the simplest example being the conversion of phenol to silicyl uh, aldehyde. The reaction was discovered by Carl Rimer and Ferdinand Timon. The rhymer in question was called rhymer, not the less known called Ludwig rhymer. It is substitution reaction. Mechanism of rhymer timer reaction. Applications The rhymer timer reaction is effective for other hydroxy aromatic compounds such as naphthols. Electro rich heterocycles such as pyrroles and doles are also known to react. Dichlorocarbenes can react with alkenes and amines to respectively form dichlorocyclopropanes and isocyanides. As such, the rhymer timon reaction may be unstable for substrates bearing these functional groups. In addition, many compounds cannot withstand being heated in the presence of hydroxide. Fry's rearrangement. The Fry's rearrangement named for the German chemist Karl Theophil Fry's is a rearrangement reaction of a phenolic ester to a hydroxy aryl ketone by electrolysis of Lewis acids. It involves migration of an acyl group of phenol ester to the aryl ring. The reaction is ortho and beta selective and one of the two products can be favored by changing reaction conditions such as temperature and solvent. Mechanism of Fry's rearrangement. Williamson synthesis. synthesis. The Williamson ether synthesis is an organic reaction forming an ether from an organohalide and or deprotonated alcohol. This reaction was developed by Alexander. Williamson in 1850 typically it involves the reaction of an alkoxide ion with a primary alkyl halide via an SN2 reaction. This reaction is important in the history of organ chemistry because it helped prove the structure of ethers. The general reaction mechanism is as follows. An example is the reaction of sodium ethoxide with chloroethane to form diethyl ether and sodium chloride. Mechanism of Williamson synthesis applications. The Williamson reaction is of broad scope, is widely used in both laboratory and industrial synthesis and remains the simplest and most popular method for of preparing ethers. Both symmetrical and 
asymmetrical ethers are easily prepared. The intermolecular reaction of halohydrins in particular gives epoxides. In the case of asymmetrical ethers, there are two possibilities for the choice of reactants, and one is usually preferable ether on the basis of availability or reactivity. The Williamson reaction is also frequently used to prepare an ether in direct form to alcohols. One of the alcohols is first converted to a leaving group, then the two are reacted together. The alkyl may be primary, secondary, or tertiary. The alkylating agent, on the other hand, is most preferably primary. Secondary alkylating agents also react, but tertiary ones are usually too prone to side reactions to be of practical use. The leaving group is most often a halide or a sulfonate ester synthesized for the purpose of the reaction. Since the conditions of the reaction are rather forcing, protecting groups are often used to specify other parts of the reacting molecules. The Williamson, Williamson ether synthesis is a common reaction in the field of organic chemistry in, in, in industrial synthesis and in undergraduate teaching laboratories. Years for these ether synthesis are traditionally low when reaction times are shortened, which can be the case with undergraduate laboratory class periods without allowing the reactions to reflux for the correct amount of time. The reaction may not proceed to completion, generating a poor overall product yield. To help mitigate this issue, microwave enhanced technology is now being utilized to speed up the reaction times for reactions such as the William sun ether synthesis this technology has transformed reaction times that required reflux of at least 1.5 hours to a quick 10 minute microwave down at 130 degree and this has increased the yield of ether synthesized from a range of 6 to 29 percent to 20 to 55 percent there have also been significant Strides in the synthesis of ethers when using temperature of 300 degree and up and using weaker alkylating agent to facilitate more efficient synthesis. This methodology helps streamline the synthesis process and makes synthesis on an industrial scale more feasible. The much higher temperature makes the weak alkylating agent more reactive and less likely to produce salts as a byproduct. This method has proved to be highly selective and especially helpful in production of aromatic ethers such as anisole, which has increasing industrial applications. Rosenmund re reduction. The Rosenmund reduction is a hydrogenation process in which an acyl chloride is selectively reduced to an aldehyde. The reaction was named after Carl Wilhelm Ros Rosenmund, who first reported it in 1918. The reaction of hydrogenolysis is catalyzed by Claudium or barium sulfate, which is sometimes called the Rosenmund catalyst. Barium sulfate has a low surface and which reduces the activity of the palladium, preventing over reduction. However, for certain reactive acyl chlorides, the activity the activity must be reduced further by the addition of a poison. Originally, this was thio Quinine-3, although thiodia has also been used.
deactivation is required because the system must reduce the acyl chloride but not the subsequent aldehyde if further reduction does take place it will create a primary alcohol which would then react with the remaining acyl chloride to form an ester rosamond catalyst can be prepared by reduction of palladium to chloride solution in the presence of bso4 typical reducing agent is formaldehyde while rosamond reduction method can be used to prepare several aldehydes formaldehyde cannot be prepared as as formal chloride is unstable at room temperature this is an organic redox reaction mechanism of rosamond reduction applications rosamond reduction reaction is used for the production of aldehydes it is used for the production of saturated fatty aldehydes it is used for the production of alkyl or aryl aryl aldehydes stefan reaction stefan aldehyde <coughs> synthesis a named reaction in chemistry was involved by henry stefan this reaction involved the preparation of aldehydes from nitriles using tin to chloride hydrochloric acid and quenching the resulting aluminum salt with water during the synthesis ammonium chloride is also produced this is an organic redox reaction mechanism of stefan reaction eater reaction the eater reaction is a chemical reaction that involves the direct oxidation of an aromatic or hydrocyclic bond methyl group to an aldehyde using chromyl chloride for example chlorine can be oxidized to benz aldehyde mechanism of eater reaction applications oxidation of toluene to benz aldehyde is quite a useful conversion benz aldehyde is routinely used for its benz aldehyde can serve as a precursor for various compounds including dyes perfumes and pharmaceuticals for example the first step in the synthesis of ephedrine is, is condensation of benz aldehyde with nitroethane Additionally, benz aldehyde is instrumental in the synthesis of fin fentanyl. And unlike other oxidizing agents, chromyl chloride does not oxidize aldehyde to carboxylic acid. Gottman-Koch reaction. The Gottman-Koch reaction, named after the German chemist. Ludwig Gottman and Julius Ar Arnold Koch is a variant of the Gottman reaction in which carbon monoxide is used instead of hydrogen cyanide. Unlike the Gottman reaction, this reaction is not applicable to phenol and phenol ether substrates, although the highly unstable formal chloride was initially postulated as an intermediate formal cation is now thought to be react directly with the uh, <coughs> arene without the initial formation of formal chloride additionally when zinc chloride is used as the newest acid instead of aluminium chloride for example or when the carbon carbon monoxide is not used at high pressure the presence of presence of copper one chloride or nickel two chloride to catalyst is often necessary the transition metal co-catalyst may serve as a carrier by first forming reacting with co to form a carbonyl complex which is then transformed into the active electrophile this is a substitute Fusion reaction.
mechanism of autoimmune coach reaction <clears throat> freedom crafts acylation the reaction proceeds through generation of an acyl acylium center the reaction is completed by deprotonation of the aluminum ion by alcl4 negative regenerating the alcl3 catalyst however in contrast to the truly catalytic alkylation reaction the form ketone is a moderate liver space which forms a complex with complex with a strong lewis acid aluminum trichloride the formation of this complex is typically irreversible under reaction condition thus a stoichiometric quantity of alcl3 is needed the complex is destroyed upon aqueous workup to give the desired ketone for example the classical synthesis of dioxy Ben Benzoin calls for 1.1 equivalents of AlCl3 with respect to the limiting reagent. Phenyl phenyl acetyl chloride. In certain cases, generally when the benzene wing is activated, Friedel-Crafts acylation can also be carried out with catalytic amounts of a milder Lewis acid. Or a bronsted acid catalyst using the anhydride or even the carboxylic acid itself as the acylation agent. If desired, the resulting ketone can be subsequently reduced to the corresponding alkane substituent by either wolf kishner reduction or Clemenson reduction. The net result is the same as the Friedel-Crafts alkylation, except that rearrangement is not possible. Applications. This reaction is related to several classic named reactions. The acylated reaction product can be converted into the alkylate product via Clemenson reduction. The Cotterman coach reaction can be used to synthesize benzaldehyde from benzene. The Gottman reaction describes a range of reactions with hydrocyanic acid. The Hoven host reaction describes a range of reactions with nitriles. A reaction modification with an aromatic phenyl ester as a reactant is called the price rearrangement. In the Skoll reaction to arrange couple directly. In the zinc sol reaction, P cres uh, is alkylated to a cyclohexadienone di, di, uh, with tetrachloromethane. In the blank chloromethylation, a chloromethyl group is added to an arrange with formaldehyde. Hydrochloric acid and zinc chloride. The Bogart Cook synthesis involves the dehydration and isomerization of one B phenyl ethyl cyclohexanol to the octahedro derivative of phenanthrene. The Dorsen's Nanitzisco synthesis of ketones involves the acylation of cyclohexene with acetyl chloride to methyl cyclohexene hexenyl ketone. In the related Nanitzisco reductive acylation, a saturated hydrocarbon is added. Making it a reductive acylation to methyl cyclohexyl ketone. The Nanke reaction is the re is, 
acetylation of phenols with acids in the presence of zinc chloride in a green chemistry radiation aluminum chloride is replaced by a graphite in an alkylation of phi xylene with two bromine butane this variation will not work with primary halides from which less carbocation involvement is referred in the infer inferred dyes friedel crafts reaction has been used in the synthesis of several triiodyl methane and xanthine dyes examples are the synthesis of thymolphthalene from two equivalents of thymol and phthalic anhydride a reaction of phthalic anhydride with re resorcinol in the presence of zinc chloride gives the fluoro for fluoroskin replacing resorcinol by an n di ethyl amino phenol in this reaction gives rhodamine b haworth reaction The Haworth reaction is a classic method for the synthesis of one tetra alone. In this reaction, benzene is reacted with succinic anhydride. The intermediate product is reduced, and a second acylation takes place with addition of acid. In a related reaction, phenanthrin is synthesized from naphthalene and succinic anhydride in a series of steps which begin with epsi acylation friedel crafts test for aromatic hydrocarbons reaction of chloroform with aromatic compounds using an aluminum chloride catalyst gives dry dry aryl methanes which are often bright colored as is the case in trial try aryl methane dyes this is a bench test for aromatic compounds